Everything okay? Uh, yeah, it's good. I, I mean, the whole thing with Ben's parents was just... Uh, we'll be a trifle more inconspicuous, I promise. A trifle? A smidge, a bit, you know. Right, a smidge. <laughs> a trifle! <laughs> You're sounding so terrifically English these days. You must come visit me in Chelsea. We'll stroll the King's Road together. Oh, that would be... <laughs> oh. Darling! <laughs> <laughs> Off to edit a wee segment. Mark, in. Ciao, lovey. Begins at home. Huh? Uh, charity. Oh, <laughs> yes. Uh, well, if it helps someone a trifle less fortunate. We never touch any of this crap. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, name a date. Dinner at our place, remember? We'll host. Really? Absolutely. We're the newcomers. We'll host first. You don't have to. Next Wednesday? Um, yeah. Lovely. We'll see you then. All right. Bye. Don't permit your voice to be high and shrill, or listless or indifferent. Don't be so good or serious to another's or arrogant stand or, or otherwise dispose themselves don't beyond repeat their comfort. Anecdotes, don't in any bad. case offer to shake don't hands with the ladies. Don't cleanse your ears more than or necessary. your nose or don't trim and clean your to shake hands don't with everybody present. To relinquish their hat don't gown you care, die. Don't go into the presence of don't ladies with heroin, guests standing when wine is not spirits, nor seated when company is being bold in your company to open a book and begin reading to yourself. Don't shoot or nurse your kiss every time the public is aware of my fault. Don't engage in confections or return them properly. Don't. Who? Don't. What? Don't. Don't. Never close any door or portal with your back. A lady's spine is a structure, not a lackey or hay there. And pray a lady does not address another with such shocking directnesses as who or what. She might as well strike the other's mattered with her bare palm. Don't stare at house guests. It is shocking. Vulgar. And rude. I was working on? Yep. Three minutes flat. And in ink. Are you Don't! The gracious lady concedes. Indeed. The only phenomenon more awful than conflict is competition. Precisely. A competitive lady, and one who wears such on her sleeve, may as well be a... a cabbage in a handcart. Telethon for the Best Friends Animal Shelter is really all about is what we as a couple are all about. Commitments. Stuart! Dedication and devotion. Please. So here's a contribution to the call. Hey, come check out Loverboy. The check that we wrote out together this morning over breakfast. So this is the guy whose wife doesn't and even know about this you, is my right? Bands are always Do not tell Ben. It's grape nuts with flaxseed, 1% milk, and centrum gold. <laughs> Pass the bucket. He is my one and only. I gotta break up with him. You think? We do. Don't shy away from difficult circumstances. Don't allow charming men to erode your principles. A young lady confronts life's trials with courage and maturity. And stands up for what is right without ever the need to raise her voice. Ah! You okay? Do you see anyone? On the stairs. Um, did you take your medications today? Uh, I'm serious! Gemma, are you seeing other people? Be serious! What, about your hallucinations? Oh, like, 
you never think there's a monster hiding in your record basement. Mm, you promised you wouldn't mention that. That was before you were making fun of me. We shall dine modestly, salad, a well-chosen steak, sorbet, accompanied, of course, by a robust red wine. Guests will be simply me, Ben and Stuart, Jared and Randall, Brian and his wife Haley. All most agreeable company. Don't forget the boy. Milton. Brian and Haley's son, Milton. Milton? Milton. Everybody's family loving it.